Hello, defense attorney Mark Rosenfeld. I wanted to talk about the booking process and what that means. When someone is booked or taken into custody, they are often photographed with what is sometimes called a mugshot and fingerprinted and their information, their name, date of birth, fingerprints are sent through the computer system to check if there's any warrants out for the person's arrest or what their uh, criminal history is. And the amount of information that is maintained in law enforcement databases is vast. They can uh, get uh, driver's license information, employment information, and they want to know who it is that they're dealing with. So many times when someone is arrested, they're taken to the station and booked, the fingerprints and photographs. Sometimes this does not happen. The person is sight released, which means they are given a ticket with a court date, and it may still be a misdemeanor or even a felony, but the person is not actually booked. What often happens is when we get to court, the prosecutor will want this booking to be done, either before the case or at the end of the case. They'll want to know and make sure they know exactly who they're dealing with and if there's any other cases out there or information that they need to know. So when this fingerprinting and photographing is done, not at the time of arrest, but once you get to court, the judge will often issue an order and that order is typically good for seven days and the person then goes down to the police station and gets booked the photograph the fingerprints the background check and it can take anywhere from half an hour to an hour and a half usually to go through this booking process and the person doesn't actually go into custody they don't go to jail they just go through the fingerprint and photograph and background check information. That is typically called the booking process and it can be ordered depending on the courthouse at the beginning of a case or if there's a conviction, they wanna make sure that ends up on the record with the accurate information. The court orders are typically good for seven days and then the judge will often set a proof of booking date in court where the person has to come back and show that they actually did this. If you've got questions about the booking process, finger, fingerprint photographs, and what actually takes place, feel free to give me a call. I handle cases in Southern California. Offices are in Beverly Hills. You can reach me at 310-424-3145.